Okay, hey guys, so I've already done my foundation base and my eyes and my lashes. I'm wearing the 218 Red Cherry Lashes. And today I'm just going to show you how to contour your face. Well, how I contour my face. I know there are so many like ways of doing it because some people have like um, higher bridges and things like that. They have more prominent um, cheekbones. But I'll just show you how like um, to contour and the reasons why I contour. Okay, so I like using the Passerella Set 5. No, wait, sorry, Set 6. Um, NP set. What I like about this is that it is, um, it doesn't have all the oils drawn out of it, so it is quite nice and, um, I don't know, like it just rolls off the brush and rolls onto your skin a lot easier than something like a, um, like the camera finish to contour with. So I get my 10R sculpting brush, and seeing as my eye area here isn't as deep as a kind of probably a Caucasian's, um, eye area, I like to just shade into that area just up there then I like to shade right near the sides of my nose just to elevate that area and to slim down the nose as well contouring makes such a difference honestly Okay, then I like to grab my BR16, just use it to shade down the nose, use it like that way, straight ways and shade down the nose, again straight ways, shade down the nose, blend downwards as well, just to give it that really sharp look. Okay, then I am going to take my BR20. Which is that one. Get the passerella set six again. And you want to contour right underneath that cheekbone area. And always blend downwards. And this just emphasizes the cheekbone area. I don't know if you can see that kind of, um, like that depth that's been created now. And I sometimes like to contour right on top of the cheekbone area, just like a streak down. After that, I like to contour on the sides of my forehead just to slim that area down. Down my neck just to blend everything. Down that chin area. Jaw, sorry. You don't want to um, shade it in too much or else it looks like a beard or something like that. So do be careful with that. Okay. So I've grabbed the two. This is the bronzer. Take your BR20 again. And kind of just go on to that area, start to shade that area, just a little bit higher than what you put that um, passerella set six. And again, it just creates depth, but also adds color. Down sides of the face, I mean the sides of the forehead. Grab your blusher. You really just want to add this to this area. I don't know if you can see that properly. That area. Nothing above the cheekbone area. Because then you're just bringing up the blush too high.
Okay. okay. Then grab your blush patrol. And what you want to do is apply this shimmer kind of color to the actual cheekbone. And that will highlight that area and also help emphasize that area as well. Bring it out a lot more. For your nose area as well, you want to just use something like this Skinny Dip Color Disc. And just use something like a BR19 to flat brush. And just apply that to the forehead, middle of the forehead, and to the actual bridge of the nose. And that should also bring out like the height, if that makes sense, or like the, the dimensions that you've just created as well. So I don't know if you can see that properly. So as you can see, it has slimmed down the face, has slimmed down the forehead as well, created more of a bridge. And um, yeah, it's pretty easy. I'll put a link of like what books um, have some good like contouring tips as well. Some of them are quite amazing. So yeah. Okay. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this and um, stay tuned.